All right, well, a Gilbert coffee shop is hosting an event this morning, donating money to the March of Dimes, which helps preemie babies. Very wonderful organization. Stefania Okoli live with a little more about how everyone can help out. Right, Stefania? That's right, Anita and Ty, you know, we're just one week away from the big March of Dimes event. Uh, the march that's going to be going on downtown Phoenix the next weekend. All of this to support and to really, uh, really support the preemie babies. Uh, here today at Cold Brew Coffee in Gilbert, a setup here. Plenty of people are going to be able to come out from the community, take pictures with horses, even a special unicorn, and offer donations here. And we have our miracle baby, Dylan. I don't know if you guys remember him from last year. I certainly did. The minute I saw the name, I remembered those big, beautiful eyes. And I want you to tell us a little bit about Dylan's story and why March of Dimes is so important. Yeah, so we're really excited to be partnering up with Sweets Cold Brew and also mini equine, e I can't talk, mini equine events. Our mini horses just got here oh too God. as well. And a unicorn. And the unicorn. Um, so uh, basically, you know, we're just trying to raise funds for the walk for Team Tiny Tot. And... Uh, <laughs> transitioning here mm -hmm. and uh, so yeah you know our goal is to is to hit about 2,000 and uh, we've just we're really happy to be partnering up with sweets um, let's talk about March of Dimes research here because mm -hmm. One thing in particular that not a lot of people know is that in the NICU, Dylan actually did have to go through caffeine therapy. So every day he gets his daily dose of caffeine and it really helps keep the respiratory system in check and it keeps them alert. So that is the coffee connection. Yeah, so and I was just going to say to explain the coffee connection, um, you know, it's very interesting and unique how you guys put the two together to have kind of like a pregame event yes. um, right before the big march next weekend, which is where I met you guys last exactly. year. And Dylan is doing so healthy, so beautiful. He's doing great. And then, you know, incorporating the mini horses. Right. He's a micro preemie, mm -hmm. one pound, eight ounces, and now he's about 18 pounds. So wow. it really is an inspirational story, and uh -huh. we really just want to give people hope out there. That, oh, you know, absolutely, and it certainly gives so many people hope. Exactly. Are you hopeful? I think so. He's yeah. very hopeful. <laughs> you want to see the horses? Oh, where did the unicorn go? Oh, I think the unicorn is just getting crimped. <laughs> so this is the big part of today, Anita and Ty. You can come out, check out these beautiful mini horse. This is a mini horse. And then the unicorn is back there. This is like a week of unicorns on Fox 10. <laughs> remember, we did a unicorn story earlier in the week, if you guys remember that, um, out in Sun City. But here we have the unicorn oh, right over here. So she's magical. ready. She doesn't have her, her oh. horn. Oh, yet. she's not a unicorn yet. No, okay, she's, she's still oh. magical though, just like the March of Dimes and Baby Dylan. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> you gotta come see it. Yeah, absolutely. Come on down to Cold Brew Coffee in Gilbert. March of Dimes is an amazing cause to support, guys. Absolutely. Come out, say hi to Dylan. He's our miracle baby here today, and really just get amped up for this March next weekend. That's awesome. Well, we've been following Thanks. Dylan's story for we such have, a long he time. He was so itty bitty when he mm -hmm. was born, Whoop. and it's so amazing to see that Sorry. he's so healthy and thriving. They yeah. really do great work. They really do. Awesome job.